Hey, Tyra. Uh, first of all, very nice to meet you. I feel like we know each other from my trade room. We've never met each other. I think it's fair to say that uh, uh, on my vanilla trades, if I make 20 points, I'm expecting to see Tyra just made 20 in five lots. Tell us a bit about how you've grown with me and with Money Map and uh, your, a little bit about your background. Well, as I mentioned, the time I bought the... Uh, I just, by chance, saw the course because I've been doing stocks before and I was just losing money. Right. And I sort of look at the demo you had and I I just called you and bought it so I don't see. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't have the, you know... Actually, run through the whole um, All the videos there, isn't it? No, and it was so easy. And I spoke to you a few times. I said that you know I would never trade unless I had the grit. Right. And in terms of the vanilla trade, what uh, and, and getting up to five lots. I mean, we just had Sandy who's still on mini lots at the moment. But getting up to five lots and. Well, it's pretty punchy. <laughs> yeah, because all I did was vanilla. I didn't do any of the other trades. And right. I still do most vanillas. I may do one or two trades if they're vanillas. And they're you so up, accurate. You worked up to five lots yeah. slowly but surely. Now, I mean, if I'm not on, can you still do a vanilla trade without me? Yes. For sure. Which is exactly what I wanted to hear, believe me. Okay. Um, now, that's amazing because some people find the vanilla trades... Um, all right, if I'm on, they might dare to do them, but if I'm not on, some people go, well, I'm never quite sure of, you know, whether the one minute is too far away from the five minutes, so I shouldn't be doing it. You've managed to hone your skills on entry. Right, because yes. um, at the beginning, I was just going in at the one minute. It's, it's only recently that, you know, I became aware of you better going in higher five or 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you know, it's more accurate there, but sometimes, like you say, it may get away from you if mm. you. So I, I sometimes chance it a lot at the one minute. So how? I mean, <laughs> how many lots would you normally put on at the one? If the one minute is and five minute are fairly close together. I would start off with two. So you start off selling at the one minute box about two lots. If right. it goes up to the five minute bo bo box, if it's say what within ten points of the one minute box, right? You'll do what another I two scale lots. In another two. Right, to a maximum of five lot. And then when you're in the sell zone, you're then waiting right. for that to hold and then right. get onto those clear roads. Exactly. And, uh, and, and do you take like a little bit of the position back at 10 points and a bit more at 15, and, or, or do you wait for 20 points on five? Uh, sometimes I do either. You know, sometimes I'll take some half off and sometimes I'll just let it go. And I mean, do you feel when you, when you turn on our trade room in the morning, do you feel like you're part of a family? Oh, definitely. Because um, most of my days, um, I just basically spend a year, two hours. Right. All right. So you're, you're, you're logging on for my New York session and then you get on with other yeah, things. Yeah, because I'm retired, so I don't have anything to get up and do. <laughs> there. So. But, uh, so really, you're trading five lots for 20 points in the New York session and then you mm -hmm. enjoy the rest of the afternoon. Yeah. Excellent. Well, long may that continue, Tyra. Thanks so nice to much. see you.